Hi friends, it's Miss Jana from the Stovall Library and I have a craft idea for you today. It's something very simple but fun and you should have things at your house that you could use. We're going to make something with a corn on the cob. We're going to have some corny fun with corn on the cob. So the first thing you need to do is draw a cob of corn with the leaves attached. I'm not very good at drawing, so I went on the computer and I found this um, cob of corn with the leaves and that's my pattern. So then after I got my pattern, I cut out green leaves and I cut out a yellow corn on the cob. And I've got it all put together. And then what you can do is you can glue something onto your um, cob of corn. I have chosen buttons. So I have a button jar. So I went and I got out my button jar and I chose lots of green buttons because I seem to have lots. So I have covered my cob of corn with green buttons, but maybe your mom or dad has a bag of popcorn in the cupboard and you could go and get that um, popcorn and glue that onto your cob. That would be pretty awesome. Or maybe you have some paint that you would like to, if you have finger paint, you could finger paint on your cob. Or if you just want to use your brush or you could use a Q-tip, that makes a nice fine um, dot you could do any of those things on your cob. So you just need some glue or some paint, some buttons or a paintbrush. If you're using paint, you need your pattern for your corn on the cob, which I just cheated and I went online and I printed one off and that was very simple for me, but you can draw one and I will show you my completed project. And another thing you could do when it's all finished. So here we have my cob of corn, complete with the leaves. The thing you could do if you use buttons is put some thread or string through one of the buttonholes and you could tie string around and hang it up. Or if you have one of those um, magnetic strips, you could put a magnet on the back, put it on your fridge, whatever you choose to do with yours. I hope that you will make an interesting cob of corn with its leaves just like you would find it if you went out to the field and we're going to pull off a cob of corn. So there you have it. So I've used buttons but you be creative. You use your kernels or some paint or maybe you'll have thought of something else that you could use. So I hope you have fun making that fall craft corn on the cob. Who loves corn on the cob? I do, I do. Have fun and I will see you again with another idea. So you have fun, have a great afternoon, have a great day. I will see you soon. Bye for now.